boys on the street. Boys, so Ark's never seen this before. To give a bit of background as to why this game is even a thing. So, uh, so Ricky, the Earth uh, Rixer, went to a uh, Denmark bookstore, found a box of PS2 games which had this beautiful, beautiful game in it, brought it, brought it down to ESA summer last last year. We all played it, we all loved it, and we were all like, right. It's a horribly translated, really cheaply made Japanese game. So to give you an idea of how bad it is, if I go in the options menu and I change something, it says set up to one's own way. Yeah. <laughs> if I, and, and subsequently, if I go in there and don't change anything, it says don't set up. You cannot okay. set up. Okay, that there is no set up involved. Right, so the category I'm doing is uh, NG plus all stages. I've got a file set up for this. So essentially, this is more of like an IL showcase rather than an any percent run. So you basically get to see all the level, all the stages that um, we consider a level. There are eleven of them. So wait for it. This is when the, the soundtrack comes, indeed. Right. So the time starts when I start the first level. But some lovely translation here. Yeah, the button. No, no. Yeah, I know. I know. So, to start level, the only way to get in is to get captured, okay? Take off a weapon. Take off a weapon. Quiet court or I won't go. I so won't go. So we're going. <laughs> <laughs> we're going. Quiet going. Right. So, this is a uh, NDO or prison, whatever you want to call it. Oh, love no, I've already jumped. Right. So, this is meant to be a beat em up, but you can essentially just run past all the enemies. Uh, so... The NG Plus save we have has uh, a bunch of has like, uh, items on it that increase our running speed, which is the whole reason why it's so much faster than any percent. Uh, let me run past these guys. All right. So you can jump over those guys, but you it saves 0.19 seconds or something to <laughs> run around them. Yeah, so I'm just fastly running through all these stages. All right. So obviously a lot of this game is optimizing your lines and trying to make sure that you're just heading in the right direction. But running in a straight line in this game is incredible. so hard. So, gonna go in there. Oh, lovely, got the chair of shame. Next chair. Right, let's go. Right, so the first stage I'm doing is actually the revisit of this stage. So in the story, you actually go to this stage twice. Uh, the reason why I do this one first in the all stages run is because we need to use Ginji for this stage, but the rest of the stages we use a different partner, so it just saves menu time doing this version of the uh, stage first. Why is it called the discrimination office? <laughs> Listen, bro, I don't even know. Right, so these guys attack me. I'm going to just run around them. So, oh, around these guys. Around these guys. And the camera changes on you. Oh, nice. Does it change the controls if it does that? Uh, no. Oh. If you're holding the same direction, you will keep going forward. It's disorientating as all hell. Wow. Right, so, uh, so uh, this is a boss fight. <laughs> Oh, fighting time, here we go. And that's the boss fight. Oh, come on. <laughs> and then I'm mashing attack. My nice face. And then I'm mashing attack and jump at the end because uh, it skips an animation, which takes a lot of time to do. And then now I'm going to quickly switch the uh, partners to uh, my Yuki. When the menu comes up. Hold on. There right, we go. Uh, partner. Oh, lovely. There you go. Right. Don't let them escape this time. <laughs> this time, wait, what? Someone's like, <laughs> someone's like only a B. Yeah. Uh, so the way ranks determined in in this game is by uh, combo hits, uh, your damage taken, your time. You always basically get the best time rank because obviously you're speedrunners, but you don't get the combo stuff and you don't get the. Uh, uh, so the so is this the first? Thing. Is this the first part of the level then? Yes, that's the same level you went into. So I, so, so I have to go into this level twice and play the same first bit twice. Ah. But I go to a different area. So. Because I was going to say, like, if it's a different part of the story, why did they put the key in the same box? Oh, uh, it's. So essentially, when we first played this game, um, we realised you, you, you end up going back to these levels in the story. So we tried to find ways to clip through the doors. It just doesn't work. All oh, right. So we were like, oh, LTS. Oh, double chair of shame. It's fine. Whatever. Let's go. Nice angle, by the way. Yeah. So, run towards these guys. 
one pass. Oh, go away. I like how you hear your partner in the background just, like, just kicking like, butt. Like, she's just, she, like, she just, that's it, yep. Just, just like, beating everybody up. <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry, I've got to beat up this guy again. So... There you go. Indeed. <laughs> Better angle of the face this time. Ah. I'm just mashing some buttons. Right. So, now, uh, we're going to Gurren Street next, and... We go into this level twice as well because there's two because there's two routes for this stage, but this is the stage that's cemented to us. This is come on, get on it. So this is the stage that's cemented to us that this is this is the game that we all wanted to run. Okay. The soundtrack of this level is so good. I mean, the soundtrack sounded pretty good so far. Yeah, but this stage is what made it for us. <laughs> so go around these guys. So, obviously, I'm trying to avoid conflict at all possible opportunities. Alright, yeah, this is a banger. This is an act. We're going around the front of the box, so it's just because my camera angle. Oh, there you go. Right, sorry, it, it'll start again, but it's fine. You get to hear a little bit more of it. Oh, no, she ran out of the way. So, your partner can spawn in front of you whenever you enter a loading zone, and it gets rather annoying sometimes. So, yeah, I'm just running through the stage, just so you guys spawn there. Draw distance is lovely for enemies, but it's fine. When we first heard this, we spent forever just like playing the stage. Look around, look behind you quickly. Look behind myself. Yeah. I can't move the camera. All right, well, no, no, you look behind. Look up at the camera. Up. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Here's the chorus. This is where it gets good. Oh heck yeah! <laughs> You get to hear this twice, by the way. We come into this level twice. In there. Okay. <laughs> right. It reminds me of the Broken Thunder soundtrack. Yeah. Right, so you've, you've got to know where your camera angles are. Okay. Can we get this on Spotify? Oh, dude, none <laughs> of us, none of us, have bothered to rip this soundtrack yet, and we so should. Like, I like, I like the word "yet" in there, but yeah. None of us have bothered to do it yet. YouTube, YouTube will have it. It doesn't. We what? looked. It, we, we looked. Oh. So. There we go. Oh, nice. I'll show that on the next thing because the entering the boss level has got the most hilarious di the, the most hilarious and dialogue as well. So here's a boss. There's a boss. And this is just because it's New Game Plus. It's OP. So you. Uh, you can do pretty similar things in anything, I think, but you're not as strong, so. You will probably get what we call a stare down. You might see one later. All right, okay. You might see one in the next stage because I'm in the repeat of this stage because I'm rubbish at it. All right, so. Repeat more music. Yes. Yes. We get to hear this wonderful soundtrack again. Oh, I didn't mean to jump. That's some time loss already because jumping is slow in this game. I love the guys on the bridge just, yeah, just like, <laughs> <laughs> Right, so... So that kick is just to avoid having to land and jump, in, and jump, jump again. Jump again, yeah. Yeah. Uh, does this game have a DP? If you do your regular punch combo, your finisher is a DP. Your finisher is an uppercut. Right, so the three guys spawn there. So as I said, this this uh, stage has an alternative route. So this is why we do them both in a row. No, it's not to just listen to the soundtrack because you know that's why we do ILs just to listen to the soundtrack. <laughs> right. Camera angle changes are so jarring. You can reset the camera, but it's not very. Useful. I was just, it's not really helping much either, is it? No, it doesn't. Um, this next, the entrance to the next bit actually, um, you can actually miss the loading zone and go behind it, it's pretty good. Aww. You, you can kind of, you can miss it, go around the back of it and come back. I was getting cute and you got a loading screen, damn it. <laughs> oh, I was trying to do it actually, I was trying to show the good stuff. Right. Oh nice, fire. Yeah dude, these guys throw molotovs and they are annoying as all crap. So now I'm going into this other, this entire other part of the stage. New area. Yeah, the entirely new area. And there are more Molotov guys, so, you know. 
exponential. Oh, oh that doesn't matter. I mean, it does, but... Oh, I get to show you stare down. Don't worry about it. There was nothing I could have done about that. But whatever. It's fine. I get to show you stare down. And the amazing run animation. <laughs> Oh god, camera, please. Right. Eat that. This is more to just show you some memes. So, I'm gonna jump up here, jump up here. Right, so when I go to enter a boss stage, it says, The enemy stench is stronger than usual. <laughs> we made it, or let's split up. <laughs> we made it, or let's split up. How, 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 is the, how do we know the boss is here? We can smell so, it. <laughs> so, essentially, I can't get the quick kill now because I can't do enough damage to him, but whatever. So I'm just gonna eat and stare down. So this is what a stare down looks like. Oh, Alright. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite literally a stare down. <laughs> oh yes. And now he's stuck. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> That is brilliant. It is a <laughs> legit stare down. That's, like, That's why we call it stare down skip. <laughs> that is. We amazing. originally were like, oh, let's be like cage and call it a DM skip. No, no, it's a stare no, down no, skip. No, 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 no. This is just that is a stare down. You will take it. It's a uh, SDS. So, uh, yeah, so now we're going on to Daisanji Hospital. Alright, so first thing I'm going to do in this stage is uh, allow the weapon, so you know, because I don't need it. Allow that. <laughs> Get out of the way. So yeet that. Come here, man. <laughs> and I'm going to throw him out a wall. Clip through. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> throw a human, you can walk through walls. Yeah so, yeah, so essentially the way clips work in this game is if you can throw an enemy through a wall, you can clip through it in some way. So essentially, by throwing that guy at the wall, then holding towards the wall, his hitbox pushes you out of bounds. But it doesn't work with the females, it only works with the common thugs. Interesting. And uh, and those are the all the dudes, and not the big guys, you can't pick up the big guys. But these dudes back here, these are the common these are more common thugs. So I'm gonna bait him over. She's gonna come over and try and attack these guys, so. And there you go, there's another clip. So usually what you're meant to do in that stage is you're meant to go around and uh, open a bunch of doors and all, and all this other stuff. No, 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 you, you can just go through the walls. So, yep, uh, I need to pick up a key in this floor. The key's in this door here. Punch that, grab the key, get out of here. Right, so I don't have a weapon. Uh, you can pick one up for one of the guys, but you don't need it. I'm gonna grab this. So that's a hit max. It, it, um, makes, it fills up my super. Gauge the orange bar in the corner. <laughs> oh yeah, and wall jump. That clip is easy. You literally throw him at the wall, just hold the direction. It's so easy. So now I'm gonna- Oh, different in. dudes. And you need a super. Ah, I didn't get him. Ah, what? But, but <laughs> yeah, it's a kami hami out. But <laughs> essentially, if you get um, but essentially, if you get all of them in a row, you get the angle. Oh, and by the way, you can stun lot guys by single hitting them as well. Nice baseball bat. Yeah. Yeah, that was kind of a Ni nice special. Just yeah. Kami hami out. Yeah. That was kind of a bad stage because I didn't get the quick kill. But you know, whatever. Yeah. No, no. So next, I'm gonna go to Subway, and I'm gonna do it in a <laughs> nice, interesting way. So you can do stuff like this in this game. I just realized you meant the actual Subway, and not the sandwich shop. Oh, I'm, yeah, I'm not going to the sandwich shop. <laughs> I was like, yeah, why would you go to a sandwich shop? I was like, oh, uh, wait a minute, no, yeah. he means. Yeah, so this is Subway. Uh, so this is where the game likes to go, oh yeah, bikers exist now. Bike. And. Yeah, bikers are good. They like knock, they knock you over, and when you get knocked over, you lose your sword. And if you get knocked over, you pretty much can't do the quick kill on the boss. So you know. Yeah. Are they carrying hockey sticks? Uh, they've got pipes. So All I'm right. gonna walk over here, try and avoid these guys. A uh, guy spawned behind you as well, so nice you gotta try hot. and gotta try and dodge them as well. That always scares me. And there's a hit max here that I need to pick up. <laughs> Okay. There's more biker guys in this corridor as well. So I'd like to. I try to hang out here. Oh god. Nice. So I can. Uh, oh. I've done <laughs> done this stage quite a bit. So if I have to jump, I will. Because it's an RTA, so it's not like I'm trying to do an IL. 
where you just where where you YOLO it. Right, so now I'm gonna run over here to this side. There's more bikes that spawn. There we go. There's some more that come behind me as well. Oh god, go away please. Right, so I kept my sword through the bikes. Right, so I come in this room here. This is a this is the first instance of a force fight. So I'm gonna call my Yuki. One. Those guys can do an invincible move and he did it there, so I had to wait for him to finish his attack. Alright, so. So I'm gonna avoid these guys. You see that big uh, big metal gate there? Yeah, I'm just gonna kick it. Because of course the power of kicks is And there's than Molotov guys around this corner, so I'm trying to This guy likes to home in on you. Then there's two of them here. Right, this room's horrible. Not because of that exact reason. But it's fine, don't worry about it. I'll be able to grab a weapon in the next uh, bit Oh, anyway. so yeah, you've lost your sword now. Yeah, I've lost my sword. I can grab a weapon from here, it doesn't matter too much. Um, it's, it's a bit weaker, but I can still try and do the quick kill on, on the boss. It might not work. So, bang, they all, they all die quickly. Grab one of them. Get out of there. Yeah, so that can happen sometimes. You just get hit out of the air. Alright, so this is another room where I try and just run past everyone by baiting them in certain directions. I did that really horribly. Run past those girls. Run past them. Oh god, camera, please. Alright, so I'm nearly at the boss now. Boss in this corridor. There's a nice save point there, but why? Right, so this is the boss fight with Joe. And uh, he's on a bike. He likes to run you over, but well, he's essentially one of a bike. you can go. Nice. He's going to stare down me if I'm not careful. There you go. I, I, oh, I had one left. All right. Yeah, I nearly missed the quick kill, but whatever. And that boss fight just ends. So, it, so like, if I had my sword, the super would have killed him. Right, okay. Because it does slightly more damage than, than having the pipe. So your so, super damage is based on the weapon you have equipped? Yes. yes. Right. Yes. And, oh god. And this is something actually So I can run towards the right, go up, and go backwards. Swag. <laughs> 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 yeah, man. Street boy is filled with swag. Swag out. Right, so. I'm going into back to high school now. So I have to go in this level twice. There's two routes in this level. Uh, the first one, I need to go around and collect some keys on some big guys. And hopefully, they're cool. She got him. I'm gonna go up here just because the guys are blocking the door. Yep, they are. See, the soundtrack is... The soundtrack is brilliant. <laughs> it's, like, it's, it's, it is <laughs> on point. It's on point. There's like a couple of songs that are a bit like, really? Right, so I'm on to floor two now. So basically the key on floor one unlocks floor two, and then the key on floor two unlocks floor three, but then the key on floor three unlocks the last door on floor one. So you gotta go up and down a couple of times. Right, so this next guy spawns really weirdly. He don't spawn unless you're on this side of the table. So when you summon her, does she do her special move, basically? Yes, right. yes. essentially I'm telling her to do it with that. It's a, uh, it's a, it's like her super move. If I used my super at the same time, um, while hers is active, we actually do a double team attack. Combo super? Yeah. We do a combo super, but it's not, Ah. it's not good. As always, slow and no damage. It's fine. So, one, come on, thank you. She lags this room a little bit if you're not careful. I like that she uses a yo-yo. Yeah, she does. She uses a yolo, a yo, I can't remember. A, a yolo. A leather, a, a yo-yo with ice powers. It's pretty good. Also, this stage has been really good. <laughs> I've made like one tiny little mistake and that was it. It doesn't even matter. What about the game's history? Right, so to give a bit of background on this game, this game is originally part of the Japanese, oh my God, Ultimate Simple 2000. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Ultimate Simple 2000 series. Under the name of Ultimate Simple 2000 series. 21 Kenka Johto Yankee Banjo or something. But in Europe, they just went sod it and shoved Street Boys on Street it and Boys. shipped it. It never came out in America, so there's no American copy of this game. So. I, I love that Molotov. That Molotov is on point. Dude, and it hit someone else as <laughs> no, well. No, that's why it's on point. It's just right, like straight so, to your part. Right, so this. If I'm going to do this. Oh, really, Moyuki? So I'm going to use her suit. Yeah. She's kind of ruined this by doing the wrong move, but whatever. So I'm going to have to just kind of wait around for a second while she does stuff. While I hit things, it's fine, don't worry about it. And then I'm going to use her super. And then I'm going to use it again. And that she doesn't. I'll kick him in the air, don't worry about it, it's fine. That should be it. There you go, that's fine. I kind of messed up a bit because I didn't let her super actually come out. Um, if you you can you you can cancel the super at any point, but it doesn't have a hitbox until a certain point in in uh the animation. Mm -hmm. I kind of premature yeehawed it pretty hard. I mean, oh, six has told me to get twenty five revisit. Okay, I, I I will attempt to get it, bro. What's twenty five revisit? Uh, tied uh tied world record. Oh right, okay. I uh, have the, a twenty. Time. Right. I right. have a twenty-five in this stage. This is like the six-way tie world world record because you Who's can't really get any better. Who's gonna break it? Uh, you can't really get any better. We tried. <laughs> right. So if I get a good Molotov dodge on these guys, then ah, I wasn't that good. So twenty-five is probably dead or whatever. Oh my god. Oh yeah, and you can menu so fast that it doesn't even appear on screen. Right. So. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pull her, seven, and then I get a quick kill. Sweet. Because the reason why Mayuki's faster and Lily's 27. Oh. The reason why Mayuki's a lot faster in a lot of these stages is because her super animation, her super, uh, gives a faster death animation than. All right. Okay. Than just uh, you hitting things. The death animation is slower. So now I'm going to Tenny. <laughs> They're all like 27. Yeah, yeah. SMH, lull, dude. Lull. SMH. Feels bad. It's fine. So now I'm going to Tenu Quarter. This stage has another banging track as well. Where can we pick up these amazing games? The answer is <laughs> Denmark, isn't it? The answer is <laughs> Amazon. If you type this game in on Amazon, it, it, it genuinely just comes out. Heck yeah. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just running through. Everyone's like, 27, that's How could you do this to me? I can't believe you've done this. Right, so this stage is kind of annoying. One, gonna call cool one. One, two, three. It's fine. That was kind of slow, but whatever. These guys will run at me. They're gonna run around them really, really badly. Don't worry about it. I love the camera angle here. It's so bad. But... Come on. One, two, three. One, two, three. Die, please. Thank you. Alright, cool. Then this gate opens. And I can just jump over it. This is a chill soundtrack. I yeah. like this one. And then I can... Please use the elevator. Thank you. Alright, nice. Ele elevator has been used. Don't worry about it. Alright, so. Now we're going into the last bit, the last bit of the level. Alright, so... I can show where this game likes to lag a lot. The lag! Hey, oh, yeah, the lag. Go. Oh, big oof. Right. If you run to the right there, you avoid the lag, but I just want to show you, to show you lag. I pick up a Hitmax there, and there's another little cutscene here, and four more black uh, black coated dudes that spawn. So I'm going to run forward, run back a little bit. One. Ah, I got hit right at the end. That's really bad. So I nearly did that right, then I got hit at the end. So. This boss fight will probably go a bit spaghetti, but whatever. Spaghetti, spaghetti is fine. Probably a bit spaghetti is fine. I have to be very specific about how much damage I do on the on this one here. So I want to push her into a corner. And she is not going. I want to push her into a corner and... I want to do a specific amount of damage to her. And then... Ah, I didn't get it. But whatever. Stir down. Yeah, it's fine. Woo. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go around the back of um, 
the big dude and then I'm going to super and try and do as much damage as, as, as I can right, right now. <laughs> so where the hell are they? So. Like that and then call her for last bit of damage. There you go. Nice kid. Yeah, so I was a little bit slow on doing the damage to her because she kind of ran between a couple of corners, but whatever. I still got a quick enough kill. So that was kind of a slow stage. The world record in that stage is like 130 something, so you lose a lot of time for, lo for yeah, losing your Yeah, you're losing your, the sword, so you're losing the damage to do yeah, it quick. Yeah, yeah. So you lose a lot of time for losing swords. This is why this game is hard in RTA, because um, if you lose your sword, you lose like you lose so much time in this game. Right, so this is hard, but this is one of the only stages that has really bad music. And by bad, I mean it's not doesn't really have a soundtrack. It's just kind of generic. I was just saying, I'm, he I'm hearing bikes and thunderstorms. It's kind of generic, fer generic fairy sounds. Right, so I'm trying to avoid the bikes here and avoid the Molotovs. Obviously, in an IL, I wouldn't jump, but I want to <laughs> keep. Oh, I want to keep my sword, so you know, these guys can hit you in the back as well if you're not careful. Like that. that. <laughs> like that. Nice fall corn that we heard there. Just. <laughs> yeah, this stage just this stage doesn't really have. A it doesn't have music at all. It's sound all right. effects. All right, so there's a little skip you can do here. If you go over here, I'm gonna try and do it. I'm not very good at it, but this game's jump is really weird. So I'm gonna get on this corner. Uh, I didn't get enough distance, but whatever. And also, <laughs> your controls really jit really jittery. So jump. There you nice. Go. Got it. And then go over here. There you go. All right. So that was a little bit slow, but whatever. That skip, you basically have to run all the way around, follow like following a bunch of these signs. But if you do that, you can just jump straight over. All right. So now these guys pit. One, two, three, four. Oh please, whatever. So I got a slow death animation there, but whatever. Alright, so now it doesn't matter if I lose my sword because I throw it, I throw it away off after this fight anyway. I'm just gonna keep going in on these guys. I wanna keep this guy in the face, there we go. <laughs> right, so now I throw my sword because I don't need it. Right. I'm sorry, War Drums, I don't have the uh the uh the uh stare down skip on this guy. Um I haven't learned it yet, so I just grab barrels and I'm gonna He's in a walk throw him at this guy. Oh, please hit him. So hitting this guy with these barrels is a lot harder than it looks. Oh. oh. That's on her. Yeah. So, yeah. So, like, um, hitting the guy with the barrel is uh, actually a lot. <laughs> you, look at, you look at the thing's crotch. It's so good. The intense stare down with this, with this huge digger, dude. Right. So I'm going to oh. go over here. I'm gonna have to YOLO Wait throw this. Wait for her to... Nice hat. Dude, that YOLO throw that was is so trick. good. <clears throat> right, so. Right, so. <laughs> you can't dig that. <laughs> <laughs> right, so now. So now we're going on to the last stage. What gave it away? <laughs> that, oh, that, nice bargain. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Even more, that YOLO throw. Yeah, dude, I YOLO throw it. Right, so there's another clip at the start of this stage. Let's see if I can get it. So I'm going to bait these guys over here. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Stop wiggling. Get over here. Come on, man. I'm going to have to restart uh, because my Yuki started Yeah, she people. was started beating them up. Yeah, she started beating up on people. It's fine, though. My estimate accounts for quite a lot of mistakes, so, you know. This one's been pretty good, actually. So I'm gonna go over here. Short hop. And I'm on the ah, other side. Ah, nice. So you just get them and push you through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Short hop, and I'm on the other side. So. <laughs> Barrels one, digger zero. Yeah, man. All right. So now, my uh, I'm my regular thing with the stages. I always forget where to go. So, because I'm really bad at remembering where to go in this stage. So you know. Really bad at remember where to go in this stage. I always get the first and second floors confused because they look pretty much exactly the same. So, 
<laughs> in before, yeah, yeah, that staircase I walked up, there's actually a seam that you can just walk through. Oh. So you can click through all the stairs in this in uh, this stage. Does it cause problem or is it? No, you can just run out and run up the stairs again, or just jump and you get out. So, yeah, I'm gonna go around here. Cool, I'm through the bit where I, where I get active. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Life I, is I, 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 yeah, I'm, I'm just like, is it, you're waiting for the build up and then just. Right here. <laughs> I mean, you know, this is the final ish level. It's just the music has ramped up to the point yeah, it's just man. like. <laughs> He's going again. <laughs> <laughs> He's enjoying himself. <laughs> right, so I'm going to try and avoid as much conflict as possible because if I get into any conflict, I can lose my sword. And we want to keep it. And this stage is like a good five minutes long in any percent because of load times and such. So this way nice this way. I can never, I'm, I'm so bad at remembering where to go. Oh, I did it again. So, because this looks the same, I always go towards the box. You, you don't need the box. Because all walls are the same, I'm like, oh, hold forward, definitely forward. No, it's hold left, then forward. So, I've got to dodge through these guys, dodge around these guys. I've actually been hit by those guys before, so, you know. Around here. Run past these guys. And... This is where I got this way. <laughs> it's going, dude. Can you buy the soundtrack? Uh, if you buy a copy of the game, yes, you can just rip the soundtrack yourself. <laughs> it's not on there. We looked. No. no, nobody has like. There is not a rip of this soundtrack. That I'm pretty sure anyone's done. Oh yeah, I love the line of Molotov guys. Yeah, I was gonna say it's like we we started with one, then we got three. Just throw them all. Yeah, yeah, just the line of ah. Molotov guys. Right. So, uh, so the gimmick with this stage is uh, you can take one of two paths. We don't we we don't consider them different paths because um. Because like the final screen still shows S rank, that's how we define what's a path and what's not, kind of. That's the only reason why we include the second Guru Street one is because ah, that's the right. S rank okay. path. So we were like, well, we may as well include both. Right. So that key I picked up. There are two options that you can do. Uh, when I go to the lift, uh, when I picked up that key, there was a black door to my left. You can go through there and you can do like five, six floors of fights, or you can just go take the lift and go straight to the boss. <laughs> I'm just gonna take the left, like, jeez. That's how you get the S rank, though. You have to play through all those stages. The S rank of this stage uh... takes like 20 minutes. Gonna go through the king. But how would you know to come back down to the elevator then? Uh, because um, if you've been exploring, you would go, you would have gone up these stairs. Uh... I just know where I'm going. Yeah, because you're running it. It's just, it's just like casually, you would be like, hey, there's an elevator. Let's go use that. Yeah. So there's a lift here. Do you want to use the left? I want you know. <laughs> right, so lift on floor 59. There's some stairs here. Oh yeah, and also I don't have the uh, the uh, new boss strat war drums because I'm bad at video games, so I'm just going to do the old one and hope to God it works. Oh, here we go. <laughs> yeah, robot. Nice. And that's a quick kill on the final boss. <laughs> that's actually a PB. <laughs> hey, nice, <laughs> impressive. Marathon PB. Yeah, marathon PB. I'm the number one thug in town. So yeah, the entire point of the game is to take down this boy here. Yeah, it's a three second PB. <laughs> Hey, a PB is a PB. It means, all it means is I'm going to have to go home and time this out now. Uh, yeah, well, yeah. Where's the Rixer at? Rix is in Denmark. <laughs> yep, maybe one year. Maybe one year he'll come to UKSG. So, yeah. It's over at last. Yeah, we, oh, aban we abandoned you. It's another fine. piece of trivia about this game, right, is that in the Japanese version of this game, there's voice acting. There is voice acting in the Japanese version of this game. And the translation of this game is so lazy that the um, that the people who were 
who voice acted in this game are still in the credits. Oh. I don't know where it is in the credits, but I want to quick. I was, if it's okay, I want to show off a clip that Chris found. <laughs> the Nietzsche of Chris's clip. The Chris clip was yeah. this. Was this discovered recently? Uh, when Chris first played the game, what? Uh, how how long ago was it? Just after. Yeah, just after e, just after ESA winter. Yeah, the, the, I was going to say this. This all happened basically like within the space of a year, pretty yes, much. Yeah, like e, ESA nineteen is the yearly anniversary of Street Boys. We've pretty much what we've done is we took this game from like <laughs> non-existence to having a speedrun. So I, I want the soundtrack. Yeah, that's yeah. I won that. So I'm gonna go back in here. Yeah, it's completely useless, but it's it ah. is it is it is the best clip to end on. Because I'm, and because I'm so far underestimated, it takes no time to get there. So, I'm gonna quickly do it. Got to run through this stage again. Don't worry about it. Run past this guy. It is a fine soundtrack. Right, and I'll show you what the jump looks like. If like, you want to do the jump, you can go like that and jump around them. But it's just slightly faster to just run around them. They're my favourite kind of clip. The one that doesn't work. So let me just. Uh, it's not that it doesn't work, it's just, you know. Well, it, like, it's kind of weird. Like, it's just Is useless. Is it janky? It's just useless. <laughs> <laughs> My All right, so. I spot a morale. Hi, morale. Yep, so, this is, which is now apparently dubbed the Chris clip. Let's see if I can get it. Literally running into a wall. Get back on the wall. So it looks like you're trying to extend your hitbox through the wall. I can't get in the right position. There you hey! Go. <laughs> There's nothing you can do. Just I can kick, ready? But I can't do anything else. And, and Ginji's just running into. I was going to say, there's no kill plane, is there? There is no kill plane. So that's a soft lock. This is. Te you can restart, but yeah. yeah but it, I mean, like in terms of like that's it. Technically a soft lock. That was a uh, high marrow. So, I am looking forward to this video. So, yeah. so that was Street Boys. I hope you enjoyed. Shout out to all the Street Boys runners, particularly Ricky, JP, Wardrums, um, Six, Six, and anyone else in the Discord. We have a Discord. <laughs> we, we have a speedrun.com page. We actually have an Elite.net score system as well. <laughs> Ricky, Ricky, like made a, pay, a made a Google Doc, and basically we have ranks for nice. all our IOs and stuff. So yeah, you can feel free to cut me off at any point. Thanks for watching. Well, thank you everyone for joining us for UK 